I know you all feel the pain. And you're still feeling it. From October of 2017. When the United States failed to turn it into Bay. But now a new journey to Qatar 2022. Begins now against Brazil tonight on FS1. In this international friendly, this is the United States men's national team pregame show on SN. Welcome on in. It's been a long, long summer for fans of the United States men's national team. As you know, the U.S. failing to qualify for the World Cup. And now the the pain finally ending now that the World Cup is over. Welcome to the Quarter Technology Solutions U.S. MNT pregame show. Presented by Quarter Technology Solutions, a proud partner of SN Soccer. Now, the U.S., they have been... Very, very long summer for them. A lot of players may be inspired by some of the nations like France, Croatia, to get moving into the soccer realm. The United States take on Brazil tonight on FS1. Coming to begin 6.30 p.m. Central Time on FS1. Now, real quick, I just want to say, very impressed on how some of the teams did in in a Russia 2018. It's been like a month and a half since the World Cup final. And now we're all jumping in our seats ready for the next World Cup. At least most of us are. But sometimes you just gotta relax and the USMNT, they have felt a lot of pain over the last few months. Just suffering. And now it's finally time for the USMNT. They have Brazil coming up. Now the Brazilians, they were knocked out in the quarterfinal to Belgium. A uh, great World Cup, but better than Mexico. They did Brazil beat Mexico in the round of 16. And now the World Cup is over. Now it's time to get some international friendlies in the United States scheduling. Brazil, a great schedule for the USMNT to get Brazil on the schedule. To bring some talent in the United States. Into New Jersey, of course. On 9-11. It will be. Mexico in the United States. From Nashville, Tennessee. This game in New Jersey. East Rutherford, New Jersey. At MetLife Stadium. That potentially the site of the 2026 World Cup Final. I'm not exactly sure where the 2026 World Cup Final will be. I haven't done my research since we won the bid. But the USA, they... Now, I don't know really what to do on these shows. There's not really competitive aspect. But... I do expect a lot of the United States. And I think the U.S. will win against Brazil. Brazil is not trying to really win. They're trying to experiment as well with some players. Some young talent. I don't think we're going to see... We, I don't know about if we're going to see Neymar or anything like that. But the U.S., they're trying to win this game, okay? It's not a competitive game, but a game's a game. A match is a match, okay? You don't let up off the gas pedal. Not until the game is won.
Okay. I'm really looking forward to this game. It's in New Jersey again. Uh, the USA against Brazil. That should be a real good one. So guys, make sure to check out the game on FS1. If you want to see some U.S. talent of the Christian Pulisic not, not in action due to an injury he suffered. But the Americans take on Brazil in this world-class matchup. Hopefully they can get to Qatar in 2022. And hopefully we don't have to hear about the U.S. not making the World Cup ever again. Hopefully we have a good, good summer. Of, hopefully we have a good summer next summer at the Women's World Cup. That's June 7th on Fox and FS1. So yeah, that will be... An experience to watch. Hopefully, U.S. Women's National Team makes World Cup and, of course, knocks some people out. Thanks for watching your soccer on SN. We'll be back Tuesday night for the Mexicans against the Americans. That one, we're going to be picking a winner. Okay. Have a good one.